My name is Jim Thomas and welcome to the Fitness Management Update. Our topic today is secrets to getting a higher membership fee in your gym. And of course, we see this frequently with, you know, clubs that, you know, they, they lower their rates, you know, adjust that pricing. Uh, salespeople continually, you know, sell the lowest price on your membership sheet. And when you want to look at this and say, hey, should we really lower our price? You know, why are we selling the cheapest amount? You know, let's take a look at some of the things that can make a significant difference in your ability to get a higher membership fee. And for that matter, your ability to get, you know, bigger personal training packages and really anything in that uh, in that particular uh, uh, venue. Uh, number one, you know, the key to selling is confidence. You know, we have to have confidence. And one of the things that's going to give us confidence is knowledge. And so one of the first things we want to make sure that we're doing is we are getting regular training in the process. Number two, we're talking about getting a higher membership fee. We're talking about selling higher packages. You must believe so strongly in your gym. You must be you must believe so strongly in your level of services. You must believe so strongly that, that your gym, your fitness center, your health club, that is the place where this customer can get the results they're looking for. You must be sold yourself. And if you're not closing, number one, if you're not closing at higher membership fee level, you are not sold. And this is crucial to remember. And the numbers will tell the story. If you're continually getting you know, lower membership fees, at some level, you are not sold. You are the one that decides on the price, not the prospect. It's your job to create such a level of value that they want to do this. Okay, people will buy when value exceeds the price. And this gets back to our selling of that super objective and that powerful why. One of the things you wanna make sure that you do, and make this a little bit of a homework assignment today or for you folks that are listening uh, later, you know, what makes you different? What makes your gym different? What makes your gym unique? What makes it different and unique than that of your competition? How do you set yourself apart? Make a list on this, okay? Know exactly what it is. If it's the same thing, you turn it into that commodity, value you know, becomes uh, lower than the price, and you become that commodity. That's not where you want to be. And finally, you must be sold so deeply that it cannot be challenged. You are so convinced that your facility is the absolute best. It is the place to get the results they're looking for, not only for today, but for tomorrow. When you reach that point, you're going to find you're going to start getting a higher membership fee in your gym. My name is Jim Thomas, and this has been the Fitness Management Update.